He's like, but I would offer Jed and Ty X amount of time of safety, at least a couple weeks. That's what he said. And I was like, okay. And he's like, I need you to tell them that for me. And I was like, I will. And then I was like, how can I trust you? And he's like, how can I trust you? He's like, but I'm trusting that you're putting me on the block and that you have something more planned. And then he's like, obviously you're not going to put the guys up this week. That would be the dumbest thing you would ever do. Right. Um, he's like, you're not wasting your HOH on Tara or Tina. And then he's like, obviously I've seen like you getting closer with Keith. He's like, that could be a move. But like, if I pull myself off, it's clear what you're going to do. And then I was like, it can't be clear. Like, I don't want it to be clear. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't want it. It can't get out. I know. So I said, okay, roll it. I was like, whatever you're thinking right now, I was like, you keep your mouth shut. I was like, or else, like, you will go home this week. Like, right. if the second it gets out, like... And any of us went on, no one's taking him home. No one's taking you down. That's what I said. I'm like, you, and he's like, Beth, I literally don't tell anybody about our conversations at all. Right. So hopefully, I, I do believe him. And it would be dumb for him to repeat it. Right. Because I was like, if this stays down low, like, you stay this week, pretty much. Yeah, because if Vic finds out... Oh, we're done. She will, yeah tell the world yeah. and we'll know that he said something yeah. yeah that's what i said i said i will know within seconds yeah like literally seconds that I will know. come flying through here <laughs> yeah. yeah within seconds yeah um and then i was like you have no safety moving forward you don't have anybody moving forward like done and he was like seriously and he's like this could be my way of like getting good with you and he's like um if you guys were to like if one of the guys were to use the veto on me like i would promise them some safety and he's like, through the eviction, the double eviction, which would be fucking huge, Dad. Yeah. Maybe. What do you think about that? Uh, listen, my only reservation was Roe. If he's on board and he's promising safety, I will take him off the block if I win. Because she's way better. She has a way better chance of going home beside Tina, Tara. I know. No one's voting Tara out. I know. So that was my conversation with Roe. Um, and he's like, Beth, well, he made it clear. He's like, you really need me here. Like, there are a lot of people saying your name. He's like, I will say that. Um, he's like, but it's mainly one person. And then that's when the conversation started. He's like, there's one person out there who is saying your name it's all Vic. the time. It's Vic? Yeah. Tara said the same thing. Tina said the same thing. Now, I don't know if they're working together and they made that up. But... Tara then came in here and I was very straight up with her, told her the same thing. She told me what she told you. And then she's like, are we talking about this? She's like, Let's be, are we talking about the same person, Vic? And I'm like, yes. And then she's like, okay. Um, pretty much told me, like, I, she's like, Beth, I mean it. Like, I wouldn't, like, why would I put you up? Whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, I would promise you some safety if I got off this week. She's like, I'm obviously a little bit scared, like, if you're going to put me up. But if this plan were to work out, it would be beneficial. She's like, my only fear is that she wins the veto. Mm-hmm. And pulls her all down. Yeah, exactly. That's what right? I was saying. That's pretty bad. And I told her, I'm like, at that point, girlfriend, there's nothing I can do. And I'm like, just please know that that wouldn't even, that would make my HOH complete shit, too. Right. Like, that's not good for either of us. And I, I, I wouldn't. It's not the intention. And that's a um, very, there's a small chance that happens. And one that she wins. But I said, that I said, I just kind of convinced them because I wasn't really thinking this far ahead. But I was just like, I've been thinking this like right through, even from my slot picks. I was like, I really need Vic to be as comfortable and as safe as possible. I'm like, go out there, act sad. When Vic asks you about what's going on, say, I think Rose the target, but it very well could be me too. Like, Vic needs to be chilling. So even, and then I told her, I'm like, even if Vic gets picked to play in the veto, like everyone needs to be like, throw it, throw it to Jed, or throw it, you know? Yeah. Like we need to be saying that shit. Yeah. Okay, and she so was like, okay, and I was like, fucking stay calm, please. Yeah, she has to. I was to. like, or else you're going to ruin your own game. She has to, because she's already not, kind of. Uh, I told her to be sad. Okay. Because I don't, you know how people get all weirded happy. out yeah. when she's happy? Like yes. everyone's like, what's going on? Yeah, it's okay, good. Yeah. Be right, sad. She's doing that, yeah. Be yourself. Um, and then I told Tina, I was like, please keep, <laughs> I told Tina, I'm like, please keep her calm. Yeah. And then I told Tina, I'm like, you're not going Yeah, like you, you, like, you ensured out. Tina, right? Her safety? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, girl, like, you're fine. And then she was like, oh, she's like, I didn't even, she's like, I wasn't too worried. I'm like, Did you bring okay. up Sunsetters to her? Tina? I said, final, like, final, final. Okay, final. yeah, just make sure it keeps getting pinned in her head. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, I was like, girl, I want you, like, 
sitting with me like far and she's like okay um okay so is this like the plan plan then because then i, I need to i should probably talk to ro then and say listen brother i'm so scared Jack. no it's a fun so it's a big move scared. it's a big move but i'm literally so scared i'm gonna get yelled at oh yeah you're gonna get reamed out but it's a lot though the final time. If I win the veto and I take Row off, then that's, it's like that's a plan. just bad. That's just as bad as on me as it is you. If he wins, though, she knows she's going to come to me and be like, what's best for this, though? And I'm just going to have to say, Don't keep the same and we vote out Row. So in that situation, what's stopping Row from absolutely blowing your shit up? Saying that it's Tara? Saying what? That we're voting out? Oh, wait. No. If... If, if, if Rogue doesn't come off the block, he knows he's going home, 100%. He, he, he's smarter than that. Yeah. So, in his final attempts to stay, he will tell Vic everything that you plan to do. That's the only thing. It doesn't matter? It, what else am I going to do? Well, at this point, it doesn't matter. Because it was guessed. Yeah. Hey, dude. Yeah. Hey. Oh, it's batteries. Bedtime? <laughs> no. Anything for you guys. Shut the fuck Shut up. up. <laughs> Shit. Bro, bro. <laughs> Draws the dead bed. This guy's fucking. <laughs> this guy. That's actually, that's actually pretty funny. <laughs> that is, I know, it's Joel, like literally the, the risk. The the bag. <laughs> like. Uh, it was guessed though. Yeah. He's like, no, that's fine. If, I, if you use it. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. So literally the only thing that can is the wins. Okay, so what we're saying now, which the only thing that, what has really changed before from our talk this morning is that now not only does Ro come off if he wins, but if anyone wins. Is that what you're saying? Okay. Are you okay with that? <laughs> as, long as, I get a, as long as I get some credit, <laughs> if I win. <laughs> credit? That you're in this? Yeah. Of course. <laughs> I don't care. Of course you will. Why would you? I'll pull him down. It's better for me if I pull him down. This is, I don't think Ty is aware of anything that's going on. I just want you to I know. Can you come up, please? Like, this is a big deal. He's literally going to be like. No, I came, like, cause I was going to come talk to you, but I came to the door and you were talking to Beth and, and then you were talking to Tina. So I was like, fuck, let's go downstairs. But I, I knew something was brewing. I knew a storm was brewing. Up here? Yeah, because I knew, like, after I talked to Tina and Tara, I knew what they were going to, like, they told me. So I knew they were going to pitch it to you and I knew that you would. Your wheels would start turning, and I was like, "Fuck, this is gonna happen." I know it. Are you mad about it? No, I'm not mad about it. Please be honest with me, Dad. The only reason I don't fuck, I wouldn't do it, is if Ro was being weird and like said and didn't ensure that he wouldn't put me up. He told me if like, I take him off the block, he better not put me up for at least three weeks or two weeks. You know what I'm saying? He said if the. He said that. until the double eviction, unless the double eviction is this week, then it doesn't count. He said then, okay, what then a couple mean? weeks past that. Until the double eviction, he said? Like he wouldn't put you up during the double. Okay. I don't know. Oh, he, and then at was, the end, if he If it was, was this week, this wouldn't count as a week. Yeah. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying now. So if he won the double eviction this week. It doesn't and count. I did it and I saved him. He wouldn't put me up on double eviction. Right? <laughs> yeah, but I mean, you could still just get him out. Who cares? You don't have anything to him. Oh, I'd get him out, though. Couldn't you? <laughs> yeah, but if he wins... I can be sure that he won't put me out. I'm so nervous, Chad. This is fucked. I'm, no, don't, don't, no, don't, no, don't, like, don't, don't. Like, literally don't with that why? attitude. I'm telling you what it is. Like, you're going <laughs> to get your shit reamed out. Like, it's just true, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> at the end of the day. Oh, my gosh. Like, at the end of the day, it doesn't We're doing matter. face masks tonight. Me and Vic, she came in here. Oh. oh, we have to. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just do whatever you have to do. I'm so nervous. Can we stay up tonight? Jay, you're scaring me. You're not being very good about what do you this. Mean? I'm not scaring you. I'm just saying, like, it's a big ass move. It's a sick move, though. It's so bad. Like, it's a move that will let, like, will make you beat me <laughs> at the end. <laughs> it's a sick move, though. It just it's has so to, much lying. It just has to hit. <laughs> but it, it has just to ha hit. It has to hit. That's the only thing. I just I don't like that it got out. Well, not out, but like everyone. It's kind of common sense. I just don't like that it was guessed. 
that if Ro comes down, she would go up. I think what I need to tell V. I just have to trust every. I just have to trust that no one's gonna fucking say anything. Mm -hmm. She's gonna ask. Me? Yeah. Who won? Who you put up if Ro came down? And who I think I would just say Brayden because he's gonna stay the most calm. We have a mutual understanding that he would just chill and it'd be fine. Couldn't I say that? Yeah. But does she believe that you want Tara out with that bad? Yeah. All yeah. I do is shit talk Tara. Also, Tara, all V tells Tara is that us three personally shit talk her. Like, bad. Are you serious? Wait, V tells like, Tara that we do? Literally stuff that we've said. Did she tell you? What she's, like, what stuff? Tara? Yeah. Yeah. Like what? Just that, like, she doesn't... Like personal attacks? Just like the stuff we said about how she's always complaining. Oh. I don't know. It, Tara said that. Us three. It, Tara's like, you, Jed, and Ty apparently always say that I don't deserve to be here, and I'm a really bad player, and I'm sh like, we've kind of said that stuff. So, you yeah. know it's getting out there. I knew. I knew V was... I, she kept us safe last week, so it's good, but... Yeah. No, she has to test it all. Just go. And if I have a deal with you, I'm fine. I'm, co I'm comfortable with it. And everyone will be happy with it. But the reason that I'm feeling okay with it is because Ro even said, why the fuck would I tell anyone? Like, what would that do for me? It would just get me sent home. No, yeah, it would. Tara said the same thing. Because then just no one would use it on him. <laughs> and you'd be like, well, great. Um, same thing with Tara. They're the ones who came up, came up to me and said it. Yeah, Plan yeah. Planting the seed. Yeah. So if it ever got out, I'd be like, that's on them. Yeah, because if, if it backfires, you can get out of it still. And just say like, Tina and Tara came up here. Tina and Tara came up with They it. planted, they made up all this shit. I believe you, you know, it wasn't you. I think that's the way I could go with it. So that's, the, that's the, in that scenario, it would be that road doesn't come down. And he starts starting a, st a fire in V's head. And like, he, me will go after Beth. That's what he would do. You know, he wouldn't even. What well, he, he said would, to me, though, Chad, like, I wish you could be a fly on a wall during our conversations. Like, mm -hmm. he's like, Beth, like, I want to ride it out with you. <gasps> like, he says, like, no one will ever know. Mm -hmm. Which is sick for us. You trying to take my girl? What's going on here? No, I'm getting them out. <laughs> Imagine. The most emotional move of the season. Yeah. <laughs> a rogue vote in a, in a back door. Yeah. I'm like, dude. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. A rogue vote. <laughs> okay. So, like, even, like, even jokes with Kiefer saying, like, backdoor bath and stuff, like, fucking cut that out. Oh, like, yeah. None of that shit this week. No, no, no. Like, no. don't you, cause she'll be like, maybe no. like the one time she actually hears it, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. None of that shit. I'll tell Keith to stop doing that. Like, I didn't even think about it, but until this week, uh, like, I'm, I'm literally doing that, so. I just hope she doesn't get picked. And if she does get picked, I'm gonna ask her to throw it. <laughs> this is sick. I'm like, baby, you gotta throw it. But there's gotta be a plan. Like, we don't wanna, like, hands just be like, throw it and let Ro win. For what reason? Throw it? Yeah. Like, why would you throw it? If, she, if, she wanted, if you wanted to keep it the same. I might just, I was thinking of saying something along the lines of like, if you really want that comp beast thing to stop, like, don't win this comp. Like, you don't need to win this week. Mm. Chill this week. Right. Is that good? That'd be the only way. Don't tell me to throw it. That looks sketchy as Not well. Not throw. Whenever you tell someone to throw something, it looks like sketch. Like, why throw it so I can't be safe? Yeah. So why are you coming for me? She's like, babe, you're fine this week. Oh my God, I'm, it's literally going to be the worst moment of my life when I have to do it. Holy shit. Please be normal. Oh, I'm going to be normal. What? So if I win... I'm not telling Brayden. I don't so think... So if I win the veto, I'm taking Rhoda out. <laughs> That's nuts. But he needs to know that, like, there's something there. Or, I don't know, 
unless you uh, you have to have a deal with him. If I win the veto, you can't use it on. No, I'll talk. Like I'll just talk to him, and that's when I'll solidify something. Tara asked. She was like, "So, like, what happens with Jed or Ty win the veto? Who's you taking down?" In my head, I'm like, "You fucking idiot! It's for all." Do so you think I'll take her down? Yeah. Why? But I said, and I'm for, like, and put who up? I said for this to work, love, like, and I, I told her, I'm like, please don't be offended. You're not a good move. <laughs> I literally told her that too. Yeah, and uh-huh. she was like, kind of, she was kind of like, oh. Well, I said. But then I like kind of pumped her tires and because, oh yeah, she's like, can I just ask you one thing? Like, I'm not throwing Tina under the bus or anything, but like, why me and not Tina? Mm. Why? Mm. And I was like, and surprised. then this is kind of when I pumped her tires up a little bit. I'm like, girl, like, whenever you come up with, like, whenever you guys are walking around, I'm like, you're the talker. Like, Tina doesn't do any talking. And then I was like, you came to us with the Austin idea of something that we never really even thought about. And I was like, you're a good player. Like, just relax. Uh, you're good. You are good. I just, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. It's I don't know the balls are this. It's a nervous. It's a nervous. Oh, situation. my gosh. Where's Ty? He's in a show mess. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's in love. I can't even get him away. I don't know. I know. No, he's actually in love. He's actually hilarious. I know. Oh, it's sick, I got you. We're up here fucking grinding. <laughs> I'm too hard to talk to Tara. And this guy is starting his show on day 35. Wrong time, time. <laughs> Wrong time. Time and place, brother. Wrong time. So moving back to Alberta. Oh my God. <laughs> then so are you. Ah, Mariachi might get a place. 